Famous Freemasons, Part 1 The First Earl Alexander of Tunis Field Marshal Harold Alexander was born on the 10th of December, 1892, in London. Educated at Harrow School, he began his military training at Sandhurst, which led him to be commissioned in the Irish Guards in 1911. During the First World War, he was awarded the Military Cross for his meritorious service in the field. At the outbreak of the Second World War, Lord Alexander was a Major General in command of the 1st Division. Throughout World War II, he was considered a hero, and one of Britain's greatest military commanders since the Duke of Wellington. Winston Churchill believed him to be the personification of the British officer and gentleman. Liddell Hart, the military theorist, said of him, he might have been a greater commander if he had not been so nice a man. In 1944 he was promoted to Field Marshal after the capture of Tunis in 1943. After the war he was elevated in the peerage as Viscount Alexander of Tunis in 1946. That same year George VI appointed him Governor General of Canada, making him the vital link between Canadians and Head of State till 1952. Lord Alexander died aged 77 in 1969. He was a hero of his time and a famous Freemason.